What? No music? Let there be musicians! These children are all learning to read and play music without a teacher. This miracle is happening with my magical music course. It's a self-study course that teaches a complete beginner to read music and play it on the piano. No music teacher needed. Here at Washburn Academy, a year ago, only a few students could read and play music. Now the school is ringing to the sound of 40 enthusiastic pianists. My course was introduced at Washburn Academy by Gayla Gum, a staff member with no music training. At first we opened it up to the high school students only. It was offered as an elective, which means it's optional for students. We had four students sign up in the beginning. However, very soon their friends saw how much fun they were having, and before long we had 25 students on the course. Myself going with it as just being able to play, being able to impress my friends, and just being able to lighten up a room if no one, everyone's just sitting around and there's a piano. I can lighten it up and make it a bit more party atmosphere. And it's just fun, it's just fun. Eventually, the younger students started asking, can I do the course, can I do the course? And so we decided to open it up to them. They were so happy and so interested, they're incredibly drawn to the course, that it took me less than a few minutes to fill up 18 spots. This nine-year-old has never had a single lesson from a music teacher. Students walk by and they hear um, piano happening and they pop their head in and it's a uh, eight-year-old playing piano they're like whoa you know can I get on you know can, where, you know can I play can I learn that Since he started the music course, he comes straight home from school, drops his lunchbox, shoes everywhere, doesn't do his chores because he wants to head straight for the keyboard, put the computer on, log in, and start his course. And usually when he starts, he's so excited about it, and it's nice to have that music playing in the house that um, my youngest daughter, his younger sister, joins in. So then they're both there, and they steal away somewhere, and they're uh, playing keyboard. It was super cool. I didn't know I could play the piano that fast. When I first played Oath to Joy by Beethoven, that was my favorite one. I was super happy. He started showing me how, you know, he started to learn piano. And then it was actually amazing. I was actually, I was like impressed, you know, like, oh wow. <laughs> he actually also asked me to stay more time so he can practice and keep learning. This is actually, for me as a mom, is actually a big win, you know, to have that, like, you know, see him, oh, he really liked this. It's improving um, not only his academics, but some of the other students as well that I've spoken to, that I've seen in my classroom. Their academics are improving because they're excited to finish what they're doing and come do piano, so, so it's actually fantastic. Kathy Roberts is a professional piano teacher who visits Washburn to give private lessons to a few students. I've been teaching for over 30 years and I've been very successful, right? Well, now and then I have students quit and of course, why, does, why do people quit? Of course, they don't understand everything. And I didn't pick that up and I lost a few students. And that's how it goes, you know? But then one day I was walking through the gymnasium at Washburn Academy and two of my students who had quit years ago were sitting at little keyboards and playing and having the best old time and I said 
are you doing David Dempster's course? And they said, yes, we are. And I said, oh, good. And I talked to them for a minute, and I got that they had picked up things at a lower level that I hadn't taught them. I was thrilled because these students who quit now have a chance to be piano players and or musicians. So here is a course that can be taught in a school, in a class, and the kids will get everything. That is a first. Doing this course can turn a child from a consumer of music into a creator of music. It can pull him away from the television and give him the pride and pleasure of creating something aesthetic and sharing it with others. Students on this course learn to be a real musician. Apart from the pleasure of the music itself, that leads to many life-changing benefits. He gains a feeling of confidence, pride, accomplishment and self-worth. It improves his teamwork and his willingness to participate in family and school activities. And many studies have shown that learning music raises a child's ability in academic subjects like maths and helps him be more successful in school and in life. The most exciting part is that they're doing it um, reading the actual music. So it's, it's that they're, they're learning um, another language, and it's beautiful. It's very refreshing just to be able to like, learn a new language. Like I never thought that I'd really be able to look at all these complex sheet music and say, oh, I can read that. I never thought that until this. I'm going to show you a few of the things that make this course uniquely effective and popular. First, everything is clearly and simply defined. I don't throw a lot of music concepts and terms at the student all at once. He gets them one at a time, as he needs them, with a clear and simple definition. That way, he builds a conceptual understanding of the basics of music. Definition. A note is a single musical sound, such as you hear when you push down one of the keys on your keyboard. Everything's clearly defined, and that makes it easy. I mean, the things you're showing them. A note. What's a note? You know what I mean? For ages, I didn't tell them what a note was. Next, the course goes step by step. The student masters each step before going on to the next one, so he never gets confused. So the way to find the G key is you find one of the sets of um, three of the black keys, and it'll be to the right of the first key, so, it'd be, so this would be G. It's really fun, and it's not very hard, so that's good. I like that. And I provide videos to illustrate key points, not just about music, but about how to be successful in learning music rapidly. Schools everywhere have been losing their music programs due to huge funding cuts. This barrier has now been removed. The miracle you've seen at Washburn Academy can happen in your school, even if you have no music teacher. And if you do have a music teacher, this course can greatly expand the results she can create. You can end up with a 100% musically literate student body, opening the door to creating a school choir, band or orchestra, and helping children go on to make any kind of music they want. Your school can gain the reputation as the best in your area for music training. Most parents want their children to learn music, and they will send them to your school. The only cost is a small materials fee, and if you want, you can pass that on to the parents. You can even build in a commission to fundraise for your school projects. Children love to learn music. Now you can give them the chance.